Prince Harry will be forced to put on his best charm for the U.S. president during his visit to the U.K., despite remarks from Donald Trump over the weekend, in which Meghan Markle was branded nasty. Donald Trump took a swipe at the Duchess of Sussex over the weekend during an interview in which he branded Meghan Markle nasty, a comment he later denied despite it being recorded. After arriving for his official state visit in the UK on Monday, royal commentator Victoria Arbiter explained that Prince Harry will be expected to toe the line despite his feelings of the US president during his lunch with Mr Trump. The royal expert said, the royal family will be professional and duty-bound. But Prince Harry will be going to a private lunch with the Queen on Monday with Donald Trump and the First Lady, how incredibly awkward this is going to be for Prince Harry. He will lay on his very best charm, because that is what he has been raised to do, that is what he is required to do. The CBS interviewer suggested Prince Harry may find it hard to put on his best charm with President Trump because of remarks that emerged in the press over the weekend. The royal commentator responded, it is his wife and this is where it becomes incredibly difficult. But if you remember when Kate was photographed sunbathing topless Donald Trump had comments about that. He has made also rather grotesque comments about perhaps getting lucky, for want of a better phrase, with Princess Diana, he has got to meet Prince William at this state banquet. So I think yes they are all sort of aware of Donald Trump, and how he has put his foot in it on numerous occasions. But Harry is there to support his grandmother, he will also be there to say thank you to Melania Trump, because she did lead the US team to Toronto in 2017 for the Invitas Games. Harry is passionate about the Invitas Games and it would have meant a lot that she was there for that. So yes Meghan is his wife, but Harry is just going to have to toe the line which is what the royal family doesn't mind that he doesn't say anything. Donald Trump was interviewed and asked for a response regarding Meghan Markle's comments during the 2016 U.S. election that she would move to Canada if he was elected as President of the United States. During the interview with The Sun, Mr. Trump replied, A lot of people are moving here, so what can I say? No, I didn't know that she was nasty.